State officials from around the country gathered at the White House to discuss solutions for providing affordable child care for families. KCAU 9's Alexandra Limon reports from D.C. Child care is so expensive, it's forcing some parents out of the workforce. The system we have right now just does not work. But New Mexico Governor Michelle Lujan Grisham says an influx of federal funds creates a huge opportunity. She says infrastructure money and pandemic relief mean states can spend less on previously planned projects and can instead use those funds to create child care initiatives. We've done uh, nearly 40% raises in salaries, particularly for early childhood education. In Colorado, lawmakers made universal pre-K a reality. It opens up next month. So we are so excited. We already had 30,000 families who have signed up. And one idea that several states are already employing is creating a secretary position or government department that's dedicated solely to the issue of affordable quality child care. Officials say affordable child care brings parents back into the workforce and helps businesses and the economy. That's what propelled Michigan to create the TriShare program. Basically, employers, the state, and families each pay a third of the child care costs. It brings business to the table to help solve a problem they have, which is a lack of workforce. Lujan Grisham also recommends that states ensure any improvements to the child care industry are permanent. In New Mexico, it's a constitutional right to child care. In Washington, Alexandra Limon.